What? 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 That was new. What? Nope. Hello my fellow freaks, I'm your Dark Overlord, the Chaotic Freak, and welcome back to Doki Doki Literature Club. This time I'm with my friend Megan. Say hi, Megan. Hi! She's been playing Doki Doki Literature Club along with me. This is our second recording of this, because we kind of fudged up earlier, but we didn't see anything too weird. Well, Megan thought she saw one thing, so keep an eye out for it. Um, but yeah, we're still writing your poem for the next day. Okay. Okay, so uncanny? Uncanny or dark? It's not uncanny. Yeah. Um uh, everything's out of order now, crap. <laughs> uh incongruent. Go with incongruent. That's the only one that seems like it would be Um Maybe Embrace would have been I doubt it. Marshmallow! By the way guys, we're carrying to Yuri. Uh, we're not carrying to Kanetsuki. We want to see what happens with Yuri if we go with her. So we're carrying to her completely. Uh, Judgment? Grief. Or grief. You could go for full dark. I'm trying to go for, I'm trying to go for, you know, deep story, not just pure dark and sadness. But that's the best kind of story ever. I mean, this game is pretty much pure dark and sadness if you think about it. Well, except for Monica, of course, Monica seems pretty happy with all of it. Because Monica... <laughs> because Monica makes it Entropy. go fair way. Yeah. <laughs> um, universe, portrait, comfort, romance, dazzle, wonderful, precious, desire, desire. Desire. Melancholy, fester, misery, disoriented, tenacious, despise, awesome, firefly, sweet, play. Misery? Misery. Obviously. Unrestrained. Uh, yeah. Memories? Or pleasure? No. Pleasure. Cry. Wait, pleasure goes to Yuri though. Doesn't does that happen last time? I don't remember. Pleasure. Yep, I was right. Okay. And yeah, by the way, you're right. Her eyes do. Are, okay, so the thing we saw before, Megan thought she saw uh, Yuri's face go white and like get black eyes. It was eyes at the very end after you made all yeah. the choices when I saw it. Yeah, black eyes and blood dripping down. I just saw her her eyes just be slits. Now I saw the black eyes before. I didn't see anything else. So this time we're gonna pay attention to her. And be careful. I'm like dead on in my eyes are like drawn to her. Secretive? Or uh, yeah. So secretive. What? What? Whoa, 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 what? What is this? I don't Maybe... know, but obviously click it. I mean. Ah! What ah! Ah! What just happened? <laughs> Yuri's over here. Oh, okay. oh, whoa. I clicked her and she moved. Or I didn't click her, I just moved my mouse over there and she moved. Um. Um, um, um. <laughs> extraordinary? <laughs> sure! I mean, we don't have. Uh, horror! Uh, un uncontrollable? No, horror! Horror! Oh god, she's moving! <laughs> oh god! Maybe we shouldn't have clicked on that! Maybe not! <laughs> I don't hear any music, do you? No! Vivid? Oh, she sure. jumped because I did something that she wanted! That's what she moved, I think. I think she oh. jumped. Oh, oh existence. Seven. Existence. Oh, there you go. Uh, okay, maybe that's not why she moved then. Okay. Hopeless. Hopeless. I'm hopelessly scared of your massacre. Massacre! <laughs> what we got here? <laughs> Incapable? Incap Incapable! <laughs> uh, passion? No! Agonizing! Well, why not passion? Or climax? Climax, there you go. Ah, I heard the little zit. Uh, Nip. Anxiety, uh, um, philosophy, uh, yes. uh, uh, depression? Depression. Please take me out of here. But I didn't do it! Ugh. Well, yeah, cuz something else happened! <laughs> By the way, Megan, last time we were recording this, no, right when I had to end the recording, because I realized we weren't recording. The skip button, it wasn't that it was grayed out, it was, it was there was a black box over it. Yes, I remember that. I thought that it was just a thing, I didn't realize that it was... Oh man, what's this right here? Oh, that's my folder, oh. By the way, um, a little quick note. Um, my friend, Neko Chibi, she's the one who, um, she's been watching my playthrough of this. She left a comment on episode 10, I think. Um, uh, apparently, whenever Sayori died, 
um, uh, uh, file was put into uh, my game fo folder somewhere. I'm not, I don't know where that folder is because like, this right here, this is this is a shortcut to Doki Doki Literature Club. Um, I don't know where the original game is located in my computer, but apparently wherever it is, there is a folder. Uh, there's a file somewhere. Um, where do you think it would be? Crap. Should I go looking for it right now? Should I even be looking for it? Probably not. So there's a folder, there's a file where it's originally located? Yeah, wherever the game was originally located, there's apparently now a new a new file in there with some apparently, apparently with some information on it. Yeah, I'll go find it later. For now, let's worry about this. Well, so, mine's where it normally was, and I don't see anything new. I don't know. Well, I'll, I'll go look for it some other time. I, I think if we watch the game theory video on it, then we'll probably learn more. We'll probably see it. Probably. And there's like three game, there's like three game three videos about, about this game now. All right, another day passes and it's time for the club meeting already. I've gotten a little more comfortable. Uh, I was supposed to say head over heels. I've gotten a little more comfortable here over the past couple days. In the club room, the usual scene greets me. Welcome back, Kill Team. Ah, hi, Yuri. I'm not sure if it's me or if it's Yuri's expression, but the weight of yesterday's quarrel still hangs in the air a little. Your glance over her shoulder, looking around the room. Natsuki's reading manga at her desk. Manga, manga, whatever. And surprisingly, Monica isn't here yet. Suddenly, your, your taste my arm pulls me to the corner of the room. Okay. This is a weird scenery, but okay, that's fine. It just looks weird for some reason. Is this normal? It's the same as- yeah, it's completely normal. Okay. About yesterday. It's I... just because you're not used to having interactions. Yeah. Over there in the closet. I really have need to apologize. Nothing like that has ever happened before. And something just came over me, I guess. I wasn't acting mentally sound. Please don't think we're usually like this. Not just me, but Natsuki as well. My mouse is blinking and it's freaking me out. <laughs> it's because there's all this- it's because there's Skype and this game running at the same time. <laughs> so you just keep blinking it? Yeah. Not just me, but Natsuki as well. There's like an encoding overload appearing on the bottom of my screen over and over again. Yuri. <laughs> I'm happy that you were considerate and apologized. You don't have to worry so too much. Even though I've only been here a couple days, I could tell something was off yesterday. Maybe we were just a little extra sensitive because it was our first time sharing poems. That's reasonable to assume. But whatever it was, it didn't make me think any less of you. I'd already decided that there's no way you can be a bad person. You know, unless you're a cannibal. <laughs> <laughs> and now that you're apologizing, I know you really didn't mean it. Uh, uh, chaotic. Don't say those kinds of things so frankly. By the way, Megan, I want to point out something. Before, huh. the face was lower left was Yuri's, because we were carrying to her the whole time. Like, there was never once something that was for Natsuki, and then it went to her. If we had done purely Natsuki and nothing on Yuri, do you think that she would have been the face in the lower left? I have no idea. <laughs> Yeah. They make me a little too happy. Oh, oh? Boy. They really... make your grand your girl who tremble. <laughs> <I'm> really... <laughs> they make you seem far more attractive than you were before. <laughs> I'm really glad it's that you're such an audacious <laughs> I'm really glad that you're such an understanding person. And I'm really glad that you've joined you joined this club. Even everything is a little bit brighter with you around and dash ah. Uh, so yeah. what am I saying right now? I'm gonna blush and look away and play with my hair to make me seem even so more attractive. Now she's in love with dashes and dots, and you. And right? You the dash. Love, first it was the dots. Then it was me. Well, for, actually, first it was me. Then it was the dots. Then it was Sayori's death. Dashes. Now it's the dashes. She gets around, doesn't she? Yeah. She. This. This girl is like. Well, uh, you know, she is a grammar type person, so it makes sense she should be in love with grammar. She's not as. She's not as. She I. I just. Hey, have you seen- have you guys seen Monica? No, wow, not Natsuki, what a cock block. <laughs> like, For real. That was straight okay. up a cock block. I'm sorry, but the, the game did that on purpose, too. Just wait, though. <sighs> I mean, I'm gonna say something in a minute once you figure it out. Uh, okay. No, I haven't. I was also kind of wondering where she was. Man. Yuri, I'm guessing you haven't either. 
silence. Wait, why, why is she not saying anything? Yuri is clearly taken back by how calmly Natsuki is dressing her. Oh, because probably what she said to Natsuki the other day. Oh, did Monica delete, her me delete Natsuki's memories? Ooh. Yes, because if you remember um, back after they had the fight, Monica's like, don't worry, it'll all be forgotten tomorrow. She said, and I bet Natsuki will forget all about it. She I mean, I was joking that she might delete Natsuki's memories, but she legitimately did it. She legitimately deleted Natsuki's memories. Because if you read on, she's going to say, like, you're weird. Wow. And stuff. No, I haven't. She legitimately erased Natsuki's memories, so Natsuki has no idea what happened yesterday. Oh my god. Jeez, I not like her at all. I know it's stupid, but I can't help but worry a little bit. Dots. What? Why are you just looking at me like that? Uh, um, Natsuki, about yesterday, I, I just wanted to apologize. I promise I didn't mean any, any of the things I said. And I'll do my best to stay under control from now on. So, Yuri, what the heck are you talking about? Did you, did you do something yesterday? Eh? Jeez. Whatever's in your mind, I'm sure it was nothing. Oh man, I hate when it's the black text. I don't even remember anything bad that ha bad happening. Is this black text to be like Monica's and because by Monica's interference, I wonder? I think so. That makes sense, because the. Oh man. Oh man. Because it didn't start popping up until after she was no longer in the picture. Yeah. Also, I saw Black Text somewhere else. It's gonna be through one of my episodes. I saw it somewhere, but I don't remember where. Hmm. It's come out a couple of times. Yeah, I think I think at some point my character said it at one point to someone. With Black Text. I think it was, um... If I remember correctly, it was probably after the first day after we found out what happened to Day Ordi. When the whole day started all over again. Yeah, I think it was sometime in there. I think it was like whenever, like the end of that day, yeah. Luna. Okay. Sorry. By the way, if you randomly hear me say Luna, that's just my dog who decides that she wants to lay all over me. <laughs> that's a good dog. I don't She's even. A I don't dog. even remember anything bad. Ha I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do not see you in a robot voice. Hang on. I don't even remember anything bad happening. Oh, don't you oh no! I was trying to do a deep voice, but I actually failed. You're the oh, kind of person who worries too much right. about the little things, aren't you? <laughs> He's like, ah, ah. <laughs> Thoughts. <laughs> but, but. Well, I said your apology anyway, if it helps you feel better about it. Besides, it's kind of nice to hear, since I was, excuse me, always afraid that you secretly hated me or something like that. Boom. Mic drop. <laughs> okay, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that Yuri, that Yuri told Natsuki to go kill herself. What? I think that's what Yuri said when we left the classroom, and then uh, Suki like left crying. I think oh, Yuri said, "Go kill yourself." Crying. What? And she ran out crying. Yeah, I think that's what Yuri said. I mean, think about it. Now Suki was even tell was like saying things like, uh, "You already cut your like you cut yourself and stuff." Yuri was getting pretty heated up about it. And then she's like, "I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it." Yeah, and she was like worried something horrible was gonna happen. I think she straight up told him that Suki would to make kill sense. Herself. Oh man. <laughs> no, no, not at all. I don't hate you. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I well, love you're kind of weird, but I don't hate you either. Dots. Let's you are not. Let's see turns to me. You're still on trial, though. Oh, jeez. Th <laughs> thanks. <laughs> thanks, Natsuki. Like, I like her, but you, uh, not so much. Well, I mean, girl powers. So of course, they're gonna be friends. Oh man, Natsuki. <laughs> hey. He's, yeah, stand up for yourself. Suddenly the door swings open. Boom! Sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm super, here! You want, you want to play Monica's voice? Sure. Sorry, I'm super sorry. Ah, there you are. I, I didn't mean to be late. I hope you guys weren't worried or anything. Nah. Well, Natsuki was. <laughs> <laughs> I like the fang! I, I, I don't know why, but I love her fang. I know, it's so cute! 
anyway, I, I was not. <laughs> okay, your your laugh with her is creepy. It works. <laughs> what took you so long anyway? Ah, by the way, uh, just so you know, from when I'm seeing it, it there's kind of like it's probably a little bit of a delay. Yeah, I noticed that. When I see it. So that's why, like, it might pop up on your screen and take me a few minutes, or a few seconds to actually yeah, read it. Yeah, I noticed that already. But it's fine, well, my last period was study hall. To be honest, I kind of just got back. Fine. Wasn't this the piano the first time through? Just, uh, uh, Huh? Keep going. I thought, I thought it was the piano the first time through. Just keep going. No, it, they, they did do study hall. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ugh, that was enough, you know. Alright. That makes no sense, though. You would have heard the bell ring, at least. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Oh, yeah, right. I must not have heard it since I was practicing piano. No, but the first time it does say that she was in study on, they're like, well, you should have would have heard the bell, and I was like, oh, yeah, but I was playing piano. Right, yeah, so this... So that's all the same. Yeah, this is the same text. Okay. Okay. Uh, piano? I wasn't aware you played music as, as well, Monica. <laughs> Don't give me more credit than I deserve. I guess I've been practicing for a while, but I'm still not really good yet. Still. That must require a lot of dedication. So I'm still impressed. Okay. That, like, character position does not work on the far left of the screen, Monica. It, it just doesn't. Oh, well, thanks, Yuri. Swirly <laughs> thing. <laughs> you should play something for, for us some time. <laughs> that... Monica looks at me. Well, I am working. Right, working on writing a song, but it's not quite done yet. Maybe once I get a little better, I will. That sounds cool. I look forward to it. Is that so? In that case, I won't let you down, Chaotic. Oh, how sweet. I'll do it. Oh, uh, oh they disappeared. Okay, Monica smiles sweetly. She wants my she wants the entire focus of my vision to be on her specifically and her alone. <laughs> ah, I didn't mean any pressure or anything like that. Here, I'll take over her I'll take over her voice, it's just her now. <laughs> Don't worry. I was hoping that I could share it with you anyway. I guess that's why I've been practicing so much recently. Voice. What? I was enjoying doing her voice. Then continue doing her voice! Well, you're the one who's taking it away from me! Well, you go and do it! I guess that's why I've been practicing so much. I see. Not sure. Ha, you only get one line. <laughs> I'm not sure if Monica was referring to the whole clip. You know what? Saying. Forget you! <laughs> In that Bye, case, best of luck. Friend. No, Matt, make it please say like there's no Thanks. line for you. <laughs> you know it's not the same without me. So, I didn't miss anything, did I? No, not really. Just some memory wi wiping. I just not to bring up anything that the three of us talked about. <laughs> Besides, I was thinking well, he was already running into, off into the closet. Into the closet. You guys were just in front of the closet. How did you run up into the closet? I know. What? What's this everything in front of the closet? I don't understand! <laughs> Celtic. Um... Since your compliments put me in a good mood, oh. it made her girl in trouble. Do you want to uh, go to the, to a bedroom? I mean, uh, I was wondering <laughs> if you would like to spend some time together today. Uh, which is in cause, the room. I mean, in, Sorry, in the club, no. of course. In the in the club, in the club, of course. It was nasty. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I planned on it anyway. Ooh. Oh, I'm on top of my game. Oh, geez, that is a creepy happy face. I have never been the so creeped out by a happy face in my whole life. Game, what? The only time you're on top of your game in cartoon video games. <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, I, I get every 
right to pick on you. I've known you for what? A lot of years. Seven years? Um, no, uh, not that many. Six. Wait, yeah. Six. Just about. We met in 2011 because it was Gus's graduation party. Was that 2011? Yes, because he was a year ahead of me. I graduated in 2012. Well, okay, so, then it hasn't been it hasn't been quite it hasn't been quite seven years then because his graduation party wasn't you know back in early um, early 20, 2011. It was like late twenty eleven. It was in June. Right. So that's so a couple years. months. So it's been almost seven years. Wow. Still close enough. Grand, that was, that was the, the one year period where we didn't talk. But we still knew each other, and that's true. I blame that on my ex, but. Yeah, he was, him. yeah, I mean, he was literally anyway, telling you who you, couldn't be, who you couldn't, couldn't be friends with. So, yeah. Back to the game. Back to the game. Enough down memory lane. No one cares about memory lane. Yeah, no, <laughs> no one cares about our past. They just want to see what we're going to do next. Uh, well, <laughs> what I'm going to do next, anyway. What uh, you're going to um, do with your character. Okay. Again, that's still a creepy happy face, though. I'm sorry, but that really still creeps me out. <laughs> okay, can we start now? <laughs> oh. Let's find a place to sit. I want to sit on your lap. I'm being a little forceful, aren't I? Did, you, did I just say that? Next thing you know, she just throws you down and sits on your lap, being like, is this forceful now, bitch? <laughs> I'm sorry. My heart just won't stop pounding for some reason. Okay, she's I'm just growing, she don't stop pebbling! If, if that's not flirting, I don't know what is. My heart's just, my heart is just pounding and won't stop. That is so And then flirting. you're just like, don't worry about it. You're like completely oblivious, right? Like I'm the classic, and I'm the class, classic male protagonist. Who doesn't realize that ten girls are in love with him. Well, in this case, it, it's four, but now it's three. Yeah, I don't notice the Yander that's killing off one, them one by one. Because right, you don't it, even remember the other girl. Is it Yander or Yonder? I don't know. If anything, it's nice to see you have so much energy. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. but. I need to try to calm down. Because I'm here to focus our girlhood like is family, and he's about to open up the waterfall. Take your time, Megan. Too far. Too far. You take a deep breath, then pulls a copy of the book out of her bag. I'm sorry. Based on my conversation with my dad earlier, I mean, I can't go. T I I've already gone that far. I'm sorry, Megan. So you say you had a conversation with your dad earlier that has led you to be super to be making tons of sexual jokes. Uh, well, let me explain. <laughs> Go ahead, explain. So we set my dog. My dog is in heat. So we, so we've been finding this breeder to breed her with. Well, they went. My dad took her today to get to get uh inseminated. Well, earlier we were talking about you know we were wondering how they get the sperm from the dog. And I was like, oh, you know, they probably jack off the dog. And my dad was like, that can't be. You know, it's, they're right. just like, he just does it. And they're just like, well, today when he took her, of course, he had to get, he had my dog's butt facing the other dog to get him excited. Well, he gets excited. And then my dad leans over and looks at, at and looks to see what they're doing. And he just sees the vet or the, or the vet is the, just sitting there jacking off the dog to collect the semen, so... <laughs> uh, <laughs> so uh, and on that yeah, note, I... we're going to end the video here. <laughs> <laughs> so, thank you all so much for watching this. If you liked it, please sure drop a comment, leave a like, subscribe to my channel for more content. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, there's the description box below. Follow Megan on uh, nothing, because she has nothing to follow her on. But follow her anyway, just become a stalker. Um, well, I mean, I can always give you the info to put on there. <laughs> I, you don't even have any info. You only have, like, you only have, like, a Twitter and you don't even use it. No! Uh, I have a Snapchat. I have a YouTube channel. I don't post anything on YouTube. But I have a YouTube channel. I have a Facebook. I don't just have a Twitter. Okay, fine. I mean... Whatever she wants me to put in the link, in the description box, it'll be below my Twitter and my Mixer account. And <laughs> there's also a whole bunch of artists down there you should check, guys should check out. With all being said, you know our card is a fantastic day. You have no choice. 
and I will see all of you beautiful people next video. Stay free, everyone. Ciao! Bye!